What's up guys, today we're going to take a look at the 5 best 4K monitors on the market for this year. We're going to show you our 5 best picks, and we'll talk about whether or not you should buy them. If you want more information and the most up-to-date pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description below. Okay, so let's get started. Number 5. Benk SW321C PhotoVU. Best 4K monitor for photographers. Pro-level displays are no longer the premium-priced, inaccessible purchase they started out to be. At least as far as the Benk SW321C PhotoVU is concerned. This 32-inch 4K photo monitor is up a step or two in terms of both performance and usability, featuring an incredibly wide color gamut of 99% of the Adobe RGB color space and 95% of DCI P3. If you're in the cinematography or photography sphere, that's exactly what you need. And, that's on top of all the other features this monitor boasts. This is among the best 4K monitors for photo editing you'll find, and the best part is you're getting it for cheaper than all others. Number 4. Dell 4K S3221 QS Curved Monitor. Performance and design in an affordable package. Dell's 4K monitor is stunning inside and out. We love its woven arctic white design that lends to its unique elegant look, allowing it to stand out against the sea of black and grey monitors out there. Its display is impeccable as well. On top of the 4K resolution is a contrast ratio of 3000. 1. Support for 1.07 billion colors, up to 4 milliseconds response time, and a 178 out of 178 viewing angle that altogether produce stunning, crisp and vibrant visuals that are just as excellent for gaming as they are for media consumption and productivity. It isn't the cheapest 4K option out there, but the price of entry isn't bad either. And, considering what you're getting, you'll be glad to spend just a little more. Number 3. Asus Tough Gaming VG289Q. 4K meets affordability. With the Asus Tough Gaming VG289Q, you're getting a lot of value for your money, especially considering the small price of entry. One of the most affordable 4K gaming monitors right now, this 28 inch can swivel, pivot and tilt practically however which way you need it, within reason, naturally, to serve your purpose. It also has deliciously thin bezels and a nifty cable management solution, as well as a few display settings to boost your viewing experience. Thanks to its rich vibrant colors, super sharp image quality and a design that is only subtly gaming centric, this is among the best 4K monitors not only for gamers but for regular users who consume a lot of visual media as well. Number 2. Philips Brilliance 328P as both 4K panels and HDR technology become more ubiquitous, we're starting to see more affordable monitors take on the market, and the Philips Brilliance 328P does just that. This 4K monitor combines a 4K VA panel with decent HDR performance at a price point that won't force you to break open the piggy bank. Its brightness doesn't quite reach its lofty HDR 600 rating, but at this price, it's hard to complain. The Philips Brilliance 328P really is one of the best 4K monitors out there. The Philips Brilliance 328P is an excellent screen, with striking contrast, good color quality and loads of features alongside reasonable HDR. However, its HDR and colors could be a little better, and it's occasionally awkward to use. Number 1. LG Ultrafine 24MD 4KL 4K fans will find a lot to love in the LG Ultrafine 24MD 4KL, especially if they are photographers or videographers who need all that prime real estate and high resolution. From its 4K resolution and color accuracy, to its plethora of USB-C and Thunderbolt 3 ports and buttonless design, this 4K display is the perfect match for your Mac or Ultrabook. And, despite those bizarrely thick bezels and high price tag, this display might be hard to resist. The LG Ultrafine 24MD 4KL is a great monitor for fledgling photo and video editors. Its high resolution and color accuracy make it a perfect fit for anyone getting creative work done. However, the high price point and thick bezels make it hard to recommend for most everyday users. Thanks for watching and that's for all this video. If you like this video and it helped in any way, please give this video a like, and if you don't want to miss out on any future videos, subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you in the next video. Till next time, see you guys.